Hi, I'm Nick Raines. Welcome to episode two of Behind the Photograph. I've chosen this picture, which was taken in Lalibela in Ethiopia, because it illustrates an interesting point of exposure. What you've got here in this picture is the reflection of bright light on the pages of a book reflecting into the face of the priest in the photograph. Now, what that means, we've got a very bright face and a very bright area on his, his turban and, his, and his, his robe here. But behind him, it's very, very dark. And cameras have difficulty giving you a correct exposure because often they'll try to compensate for the large dark area and you'll end up with a very overexposed, small, bright area. Now, this is where electronic viewfinder cameras come into their own because you can set the camera to display overexposure warning in the viewfinder. I call it the blinkies. And what you will see when the exposure is too much, as in it's too bright, is that parts of the picture will flash. And that means they're white or beyond white. They're clipped with no detail. So in this particular circumstance, I could have gone close to the guy in the picture, taken a manual meter reading off his face, and then stepped back and recompose the picture, which takes time and, you know, we don't, we, the, he, we don't want to waste his time. He's you know, happy to have his picture pose. He's happy to pose for a picture for us. Better still, use the electronic viewfinder, set the highlight warning, use automatic exposure, aperture priority, choose the aperture that gives you the correct shutter speed, the usual thing for exposure. And then if his face and the turban is blinking in the viewfinder, you can dial in a little bit of negative exposure compensation until those flashing highlights have disappeared. That will then give you pretty much by definition a perfect exposure. It couldn't be simpler. I use that technique all the time.